Welcome to another video in our series on VAT InShots. We hope you are staying safe. In this video, we are going to talk on the input VAT recovery of various business promotion expenses. This could particularly interest corporates with a large business promotion spend. While input VAT is recoverable on expenses relating to taxable output supplies, input VAT recovery on entertainment expenses provided for free to customers, potential customers, investors or non-employees is specifically blocked under the VAT law. Entertainment expenses include hospitality of any kind and could cover expenses like accommodation, meals which are not in the normal course of a business meeting, free access to shows or events and even pleasure trips. Given the wide definition of the term entertainment, many businesses face issues and challenges in terms of recovery of input VAT on certain genuine business promotion expenses. Let us discuss a few examples. The first example we are going to talk about is expenses incurred by malls for marketing events like artist performances or workshops in the common area of the mall. The primary intention of incurring such expense is to attract the shoppers to the malls and increase the sale of the retail outlets. There is no fee being recovered for such things from the audience. These kind of expenses could be said to have an element of entertainment and hence input VAT blocked. Similar challenges could be encountered in terms of recovery of input VAT on expenses relating to festive decoration for festivals like Eid or Christmas in the malls or properties and fireworks during shopping festivals. In our experience, such expenses are generally a part of the rental and promotion agreement of the property owner and a service fee is being recovered from the retail tenants for the same. At times, these kind of expenses could be included in the rental value. Input VAT should be recoverable in such cases. The next example we are going to discuss is input VAT relating to launch events for outlets or product launches by large corporates. These events generally have live performances, food, drinks being provided to the invitees. Many a time such events are restricted to a specific audience and do not have a direct taxable output supply. These kind of expenses could be said to promote the outlet or the product and contribute to future taxable revenue and hence input VAT should be recoverable in such cases. However, there is an alternative argument which is possible here that such expenses have an element of entertainment and should be blocked. Let us discuss the key things to be kept in mind in terms of recovery of input VAT on certain business promotion expenses. The first thing to be considered is the nature of the expense. Is the expense having an element of block credit? The next things to be examined are whether the expenditure was incurred pursuant to a contractual or legal obligation and is the expenditure directly or indirectly related to a taxable output supply. It becomes important for the corporates to check the customer agreements and other documentation to find if the expenditure was required to be incurred and if there is a corresponding charge or revenue being received for the same. In terms of events, it becomes important to examine whether the event was open to public at large or was it restricted to a specific audience which could possibly give it a element of entertainment for customers and potential customers. This being a subjective issue, input VAT recovery on business promotion expenses, marketing events, launch event needs to be examined on a case-to-case -case basis. We hope the video was useful and thanks for watching.